to really get something going early. As it turned out, they did get something going early. But we kicked off because when the wind is there, it is a factor. In our first series, we stop them. They make nine yards on the first play. And then the next two downs, you look at here, on second and one and third and one, great defensive surge. Mick Thomas in there, great people underneath, and I tell you, made all the difference in the world. So we did what we wanted, which was stop them on the first series. Now, we're backed up, though, and they get a good punt off, and here's a play, just a freakish thing if I ever saw one. I mean, the ball bounces right up in their hands, and the only thing I didn't want to have happen in the ball game is that happen. you just and scrapping and fighting, and, and it just seemed like everything going uh, went on Mrs. Way for three or four games. Darnell back to pass again, but the pass rush was great last night. Great rush. I thought our Ended defensive line ball. and our line. So now Quinn's able to play a whole ball game and not take the pound and the beating he once did. Great job escaping right here. That's a tremendous job escaping and, and completing the pass to Billy Winston. That was about a, a nine-yard loss and turns into about a four-yard gain. Only problem was we don't uh, don't get it into the end zone this time. Well, it's either. a battle. We feel like there's a battle, and we're we're trying to find uh, exactly what they're doing. You see a blitz here by Mick Thomas, and we got more pressure, and the blitz forcing him to throw it quicker. Anthony Cooney, the Little Rock Mills Comet, comes through with it, and just as he did, hey, everybody sit back. And remember last year, the only turnover we got on Tulsa to score in the first half, Anthony, Anthony Cooney, Cooney got it. Turned the game around, and the big senior did it again. And he just had a great game last night. Now, we're back on offense and able to get close before the quarter ends. Well, this was, the, the turnover really did us good here. This is James hunting and pecking and keeping his legs driving. Derek Russell out there blocking. And so, uh, at the end of the quarter, right, seven now, we're, we're just giving them the big lift they need to have. This kind of a power formation, and we run, and E.D. Jackson gets his first uh, touchdown as a fighting Razorback. Young man from Kilgore who really has improved. He uh, got bunged up a little bit in the game, didn't end up finishing the game, but now it's 7-7. Seven seven. It's anybody's game once again. Here you see Darnell trying their sprint out pass and uh, try to go deep. We knew they were going to try us deep. There's Michael James. They tried, and they got by him deep, no doubt about it, and that's something we need to work on. Good, good effort here. We got some pressure up in Darnell's face and batted uh, two balls down. as Chad Rowland. Chad did a fine. Now, you see where we took over. By holding them deep, we got good field position. And now this really gave us a chance to come back with a big play, the reverse. Our first touchdown last year, with, uh, last week, was a reverse to uh, Derek. And we get good blocking, 31 yards. Get the ball down inside the there. Head. That's the tribute to our strength and to John and just the amount of effort they put in. Look at the great, great second effort. Now, I mean, we just let, uh, missed a guy on the backside, and ED still gets in the end zone. Hey, that's, that's what all that physicalness is about. That's great second effort, and that'll pay big dividends for us. Now, we've held them here. Bowling Toledo. What's going on here? We don't want to see this. Everybody they did this back. last week right here, and we had a big return on, and this is our second team quarterback. And we were alert for it. We just didn't do a good job of it at all. And uh, they're looking for it. They're, this isn't a conference game. They got everything to gain. And here the great 4-4 uh, sprinter comes through, and, does one of them died over there. He's going to jump over the barrel or something. They tie the ball game up 14 to 14. And we just can't get beat deep in a three-deep coverage. And that's something that we've learned. Unfortunately, we had to learn the hard way. Great second effort and surge by the line super drop. Right about this time, when Mark Henry is going to get hit a little bit. And we're going to have to get a great effort from Matt Pittner, the young man who's been here four years, done a great job, came by and really did a heck of a job. Here's a good blocking by Todd Gifford, good blocking by Albert Crawford. Again, two big runs by Juju to get us up. Man, when they regained it, the score was tied now. And this is coming back. Quinn's coming. Watch this throw. Great effort by James Rouse. Probably his finest play of the, the day. We needed about five more yards to get in field goal range. Super protection. Look at that protection. And a great job of James getting his feet inbound to stop the clock. No, no timeout, so we had to stop the clock so we can get up there and kick a field goal. And here, Mr. Dependable, 46-yarder, great protection, and we're getting a good snap, and he hits the ball up there and just drills it, and that's uh, the, the, the going into the wind, Jerry. I was going to say, that uh, pretty good, uh, what, 10, 15 mile per hour It's a great win. It was gusting, but 17 to 14, it they took all the compensation. super speed, and they made some big things happen with the option. Anthony's got this ball played, and the quarterback throws it perfectly over his outside shoulder, and he catches it one step before going out of bounds. 
and, and they uh, we do a great job there, Jerry, of holding the field goal, which really ties the game 17 to 17. And again, it could have it let them back in the ball game in the first drive in the third quarter. In the first five minutes, we felt we we're going to set the tempo of the ball game. And so with the score tied 17 to 17, probably the greatest drive we had all night was this one. Look at Tim picking up the balance and getting a, a big 28 yards. And here's, here's a slow-mo of it. We get good blocking. Quinn's got a chance to come down the line off our option fake. Hits the ball to Tim and does a great job limp-legging. Look at there. Great balance that he has. And this drive here was just, you, you call a thing of beauty, this was right with the score tied 17 to 17. Most receivers would have fallen, but I've seen Tim do that a number of times. He has great balance. And look at this great running. Great second effort, Barry. I mean, that's the way to take him on and pull that sled one more time. And, and this is what you got to do. You got to dominate the line of scrimmage and physically take it to him. One of the best plays of all year. He's double covered, and watch this. Drills the ball to Derek for the score. Derek gets a touchdown on reverse, touchdown on that, a, a touchdown pass for Quinn. But they had him double covered. I thought Quinn was going to really run it in, but he found him right at the corner of the end zone, and we're ahead 24 to 17. Now the game begins. All the scoring's over, but the game begins. We let them outside on the option. They had outstanding speed, and, and, and this team mixed up the option drop back pass better than any we played in a long time. Kind of remembers last year when we played A&M, although they didn't throw the ball that well. Super effort. Get a great sack Up there. In the fourth quarter. And uh, it made the difference of, of us getting up two scores. Quinn comes back here. He's got time. And now he throws this one up. And this is as good as a punt down there. We didn't have to punt because they throw an interception. He throws two interceptions. In the fourth one, quarter. the first play. And, and certainly we had to stop them. We had to try to run the clock out. And again, we just need one more score. You see how much blitzing we ended up doing. We felt like we had to put a lot of pressure. And we get a couple of things done, but we just don't get the other one. Here you're going to see a great catch by Lindy Lindsay. Boop, boop, and I got it. Jim Lindsay was there, his dad, B. Lindsay's uncle was there. They're all there for Donnie Kessler being inducted in the Mississippi Hall of Fame. And uh, we're really honored for Donnie. He is a great, great person from Far City. Here is a good running by James. Good second ever. Look at him. Keep going. Watch him, watch him, watch him. Great driving for the first down. And right then is when I really thought we had him. We were going to be within field goal range where we could kick a big ball. And I really thought we had what we wanted uh, right up at midfield. You see, we're just about a yard short, and we just come up with it. So now, all of a sudden, they start the last drive. Here it is. Let's watch it. A little quick pass. Michael James got to knock him down. The draw, the lead draw that they had so much success with last week. And uh, time's running. They're out of timeouts. We had made them use one timeout in their last... But we decided to fake it on fourth down there. And last time they used their last critical timeout, which made a big difference in the game, Jerry. Here's the play, fourth down. Doggone it, where are your feet? We just, Aaron overruns the ball here right now. Fourth down and three, the big play of the drive. And trying to play the option in the deep pass is the toughest, toughest combination for a safety man. And once Aaron does that right there, the better he's going to be. Here we have a chance right now. We've got to come up with a turnover. Patrick Williams thought he should have had that. Thought he should have. You, you can imagine the excitement. You can hear it. You can just feel it going. Our rush is getting their hands up. And he throws a drill of a pass. I mean, he just drills the ball in there. He does a tremendous job. Here's a little slant. But again, we're trying to hold them on the ground. The clock's running. The clock did not stop here, uh, start when it's supposed to. They're going to come up with a big penalty. And right here is a penalty. And see right here, as soon now, they're out. The clock should start it already. It did not stop, start for four seconds. And then this is the play. Anthony Cooney's there. We get great pressure. And let's lie. It's Chad Rowland firing. Here we got Mick Thomas coming in. They get their hand up. Ken Benson, he drill, drifts it over the middle. Anthony drives, makes the big play. Michael had his man covered. That's right. Don't run it out. And let's just take the victory. 24 to 17. That's my favorite play. Call